If you're creating radio buttons on your fillable form and you find that when you go to preview it, if you select on one of the buttons and then you go to select one underneath, you see it's disappeared. The reason for that is because these buttons are all in the same group at the moment. So what you've got to do is separate the groups so that you have either yes or no is one group, then the next line is another group and the next line is another group. So to do that, what I do is add in all my radio buttons like this. And then I will rename the choices to create the separate groups. So these first two, we see group 46, all of the choices are in that group. So I want to split these out. I want to have choice one and two in group 46. Then I want three and four in group 47. So I click on choice three and I go to the properties and then see where it says 46. I'm just changing that to group 47. And you'll see here now it's created a new group. So for choice four, then I just go to properties and change that to 47. And then for the final two, I will right click properties and I'll call this one 48. And the last one, same again, change it from 46 to 48. And then if I do a preview, you can see now that these are separate groups. Okay, so that's how I do it.